This is the Atlanta Police Department. If you're inside the red or green tent, please come out with your hands up. First at 11, we are getting a new look at the moments law enforcement closed in and shot a protester at a planned police and fire training facility. That protester, Manuel Esteban Paez Saran, was killed and an unnamed Georgia State Patrol trooper was injured. And just hours ago, Atlanta police released roughly two hours of body cam video. So here's how it all unfolded. Everybody activate their cameras. Like an infantry squad, APD officers slowly move through these woods. They zero in on this tent right here. This is the Atlanta Police Department. Please come out with your hands up. And begin to rip it apart. No one's in it, but one officer is concerned about what he found inside. Gasoline, anything that can be used to hurt. As they continue their patrol, four distinct shots are heard. Listen. And then dozens. Is this target practice? Officers appear to be confused until they figure out it's not target practice and gunfire is close by. They take cover behind trees. They can't see what has happened and wait to get a clearer picture on police radio, and then they hear this. What agency is that? Is there an active shooter in the woods? No, active shooter. Subject is barricading that tent. By the way, that barricaded suspect was later identified as Manuel Esteban Paez Turan. So here's what's next, dear folks. Last week, there was an agreement for a construction permit to be issued for the Public Safety Training Center. And late tonight, we just learned that Atlanta police are now shifting their resources to secure the property to protect those working crews. Now, we have uploaded the full body cam video online right now. You can see it right there. Just head over to 11 Alive's YouTube page.